Hey there, good morning from San Diego. Hope you're doing great. I wanted to um, share some thoughts with you I had. Do you remember the book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad? Robert Kiyosaki's great book that he had like one rich father and one poor father. Do you remember the book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad? Hey there, I see you're joining right now. Let me know if you uh, remember the book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad. I got some some thoughts to share with you around uh, smart dad, ignorant dad. If you uh, remember the book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, let me know. Give me a like or a love so I can see it. I hope you enjoy. Beautiful. Hey, it's been raining here for the last several days uh, in San Diego. Uh, but I was, I was working out this morning. I was thinking about, you know, Robert Kiyosaki. I saw one of his ads uh, on, uh, on my news feed. And I was thinking about, you know, Rich Dad taught him, you know, what to do with money. Uh, poor Dad didn't know how to manage money. Um, but I also experienced something as a child when I was, you know, more seven, eight, nine, 10, 12, 15 years old. And uh, as I was working out this morning, I was thinking about smart dad, ignorant dad. Now, do you know what the difference is between uh, ignorance and stupid? Can anybody tell me? What is the difference between ignorance and stupid? Anybody? Anybody, anybody, anybody? Happy day from San Diego. Uh, ignorance means not knowing, right? And. Um, it's in this very similar vein as rich dad, poor dad. And to uh, those of you that are waving to me hi, I gotta put my glasses to see even better. Um, so ignorance, the definition of ignorance is not knowing. Um, the definition of stupid is a little bit different. Would you agree? So when I um, was thinking about, thank you, Meredith. Meredith, Meredith. So ignorance is not knowing and uh, stupid is a little bit more challenging, right? And there are some people, and some of us that are stupid, and some that are ignorant, and some of us are a combination of both. So sometimes I'm stupid, and most of the time I'm ignorant. So, so let me explain to you what I was thinking about as I was working out this morning with Rich Dad, Poor Dad. Rich Dad taught, you know, Robert Kiyosaki what to do with money, and the um, name of the person who was the Rich Dad is Keith Cunningham. He's a, a wonderful man, very, very bright. Um, but uh, ignorance and stupid. So ignorance means not knowing. And something that I've discovered in the bulk of what I teach is the inner game, right? The inner game. So there's the outer game of what should I do, uh, whether it's to earn money, invest, protect, get out of debt. Um, uh, you know, uh, there are five pillars of financial success, right? Um, but what about what happens when you know what to do or you can find out what to do because it's easy today in 2020, 2021, uh, you can find out what to do to earn more money, right? You could find out what to do to get out of debt faster. You can find out what to do to budget and manage your money better. You can find out what to do to protect your money or assets. You can find out all of the what to do. What I find more interesting is why don't we do the things we know we should do? Like what really gets in our way, right? And this is where I'm gonna go into, uh, most people are not stupid, they're just ignorant. They don't know what's really holding them back. So maybe you can, you can help me out. Let's just have a little interaction right now. Let's talk about the inner game. What are the inner game things that causes people either A, not to find out what they should do, or B, they know what they should do, but then they don't take action. And so let me put on my glasses again. That's what happens when you're, all right. So Anita, yeah, fear, right? So fear. So when we have fear, um, what do you think happens in your brain? When we have fear, doubt, right? What causes doubt? Like what causes us to have doubt? Right? So yes, fear, but there's 50 different types of fear, right? But what's happening in our brain? We know more about the human brain than we have in the history of our species, right? It's freaking the end of 2020 right now. We have fMRI machines to look inside uh, of our brain, right? Functional magnetic resonance imaging machines or spec scan, single proton emission computated technology that can look inside the brain. Right, so we have, uh, so ego, procrastination, procrastination, supreme glamour is an effect. We procrastinate because of something, right? So what others think, Tracy, is related to our self-image. So, so far we have fears, they cause us to 
not take action, right? So far we have, you know, self-image, what other things thing people think. Let me just see, you know, participate with me. It's a lot easier. So lazy, not caring enough. Yeah, you don't have, you know, reason why to. And then Ruth, Ruth Lane, yeah, limiting beliefs, right? Limiting. So now we have fear hold us back. Limiting beliefs hold us back. Self-doubt holds us back. Our comfort zone holds us back, right? Our self-image holds us back. Do you all agree with those so far? Do you all agree with those so far? Right? So author, I'm read. Some people think they're not enough, which means it's a self-image or a limiting belief, right? Would you agree that limiting beliefs, fears, self-image, self-esteem, self-worth, uh, self-doubt, maybe I don't know what to do, so I have fears. Yeah, would you agree with the, those are the things that are holding us back? Now, let me ask you a question. Do you also agree that all of those things are mindset or emotional things? It's either mindset or emotions, right? Would you agree with that? Mindset or emotions, right? Uh, so we got acting, so mindset or emotions. So is it a fact that mindset and learning how to manage your emotions is what separates the best from the rest? Is it possible that even when you have skills, you may not take action because of one of those things? Is it possible that even when the information of how to earn more money, how to manage it better, how to protect it, how to invest wisely, how to get out of debt, um, how to you know, do all the things related to money, if the inner game isn't dialed in, you're not gonna reach the outer game of results that you want, the outer game, when you look at your bank account, when you look at your business, when you look at the job you hate and you don't leave it, when you look at any external result, if you don't like the external result, is the external result not a reflection of the inner game, right? So. Why am I sharing this with you? Well, I'm gonna invite you to something that's free. Every year, right around this time, November, middle of November, I do something called the Brainathon. And I invite four, five, six, seven of the leading brain experts in the world who specialize in eliminating fears, who specialize in eliminating limiting beliefs, who specialize in eliminating self-doubt and self-sabotage and procrastination, who specialize in upgrading people's self-image from the inside out. And if you go to my bio on the Instagram page here, you're gonna see that there's a link for this year's brand new Brainathon. It's on Saturday next week, coming up in about six days. Saturday, November the 14th, and I will be there with Dr. Sarah Mackay, an Oxford-trained neuroscientist. Uh, Nurka will be there, a master um, uh, neuro-linguistic programming expert who specializes in helping people reprogram their subconscious mind. I'll have Dr. Joan Rosenberg, who's one of the leading experts in the world on mastering your emotions, managing first, then mastering. I'll have Dr. Maria Nemeth, who helps people earn more money regardless of how old they are. I'm gonna have um, uh, Dr. Dennis Waitley, the man who worked with Neil Armstrong, who is the first man who put his feet on the moon. Um, and so this is a free event that I'm inviting you to. You'd normally spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars for an, uh, an, an event like this to help you win the inner game. And here's what I can promise you. When you invest in yourself to win the inner game, what's happening on the inside, getting rid of your limiting beliefs, understanding which fears are holding you back and learning how to release them. So you take inspired action, learning how to get motivated. When you learn how to upgrade your self image and self esteem and self worth so it matches your vision, your vision, that's when you're taking inspired action. So when we get off of this call, go to my bio on this page and share this little video with your list by going to your insights and share it, but also sign up. You can't get better than free. I can't go into your brain yet and change your neural networks and patterns, but you can learn the techniques that science has discovered just in the last 12 months, 18 months, two years, and apply it to your life so that next year you have your best year ever. If you wanna make more money, if you wanna be healthier, if you wanna be happier, if you wanna be inspired, if you wanna have a life that's full of purpose and meaning and fulfillment, then win the inner game because what's happening on the inside is what you are seeing on the outside. Would you agree with that?
Would you agree? So every day I'm going to go live here to remind you um, the event's going to be from 9 o'clock San Diego time, which is 30 minutes from now. It's 8.30 in the morning here right now. So if you want to sign up, go to my bio, go to the link and um, sign up for free. Please share it with the world. Um, we usually have 50 to 100,000 people register for it. It's free, so you need to sign up in advance. You'll also get a few videos from me over the next five days to teach you some stuff on how to focus on the inner game. I'll give you a PDF to work you know, through the events. So you can fill in the blanks and learn. Um, and like I said, I'm doing this for free. This is my eighth annual Brainathon new you've never seen this before uh it'll blow your mind and um that's my gift to you and it's it's for people who are serious it's not for people who are want to if you want to keep your stories your excuses your reasons um and you want those to control you this is not for you but if you are ready to break free if you are ready to finally take inspired action, be, uh, become aware of what is really holding you back because it's not knowledge and skills because you can get that anywhere. It's the inner game stuff. When you get the knowledge and skills and you combine it with the inner game stuff, and yes, Supri, your subconscious mind, your conscious mind integrated with your subconscious mind, that is the key to having unlimited success and unstoppable results. So does that make sense? Um, again, I, I can't do better than free. Uh, I can't do it for you, um, but I can do it with you. So if you are committed to your success, then sign up, go to the, uh, and please share this with everybody. Uh, the way that we help the world, the way that I get to help the world is, um, yes, I have programs people buy, of course. They buy my books, they buy my programs, but I also do a lot of free stuff to help you um, understand that the power is within you. The power is in there. You've got the most powerful brain in the whole universe. Every brain works the same. And when you just use it a little bit better, it's like having a supercomputer, you know, where you can turn on your brain's success switch. All right, so are you game? Uh, I just wanted to come on here quickly. Uh, this um, video will go up into, I don't know where it goes after I go on this, um, but sign up. Link is in my bio. Uh, the Brainathon for 2020-2021 uh, season will be live next Saturday, November the 14th at 9 a.m. Pacific time. You can come for an hour, come for two hours, come for three hours. People usually have parties, um, you know, uh, with their family at their home uh, during the Brainathons. We've had as many as 155,000 people sign up for the Brainathon, and we've had over 5 million C previous Brainathons. So. Sign up for this year's, uh, and I will see you next Saturday. I'm going to go live at different time zones here, and maybe I'll even take a few questions um, in, the, in the future. All right, I've got to go right now and get going for my day. Have an awesome day, and thank you for sharing.